All right, today I'm filming my yard sale finds or treasures from the weekend. Uh, there is a citywide uh, yard sale going on. I want to say there was about 20, which might be an overstatement. And there were lots of sales that were not listed on the internet. And it was always fun to find those, but, you know, it's not fun driving to them. They say, sorry, we open at 9. There was one that had a cool end table, and I was looking at it, came back. And there was not too many people at that sale. And when I went back to go look at it, it wasn't there. So I have a feeling it was already sold. I don't really know. Um, but they had lots of antiques and collectibles at that sale, but I just didn't see anything I had to have. I bought this microwave for $10 because why not? I don't know. It just looked clean. It looked like it was good usable. And I said, I'm assuming it works. Yes, it does. And the one I'm using is a little rusty on the inside, so it might be time to replace that one. This is just a Frigidaire, so it's probably not super expensive. But anyway, I figured I'd grab that one. At the next sale here, I grabbed this little figurine here. Didn't see anything at first, but I figured, you know what, John Cena, and it was only 50 cents, and uh, you can't really see that, but uh, anyway, that will be over here. So now I have John Cena figure, and somebody was looking for one of those, so that's good to have that one. This bag was 25 cents at the very next sale, and it's just a bunch of, I don't know, bits and bobs of stuff. There's one of these for... A door stopper, there's an ancient wrench in there I might be able to clean up, and some sort of thermometer light switch thing, I have no idea. Some washer, bag of washers, I don't really know, the quarter. At the exact same sale, these were a dollar for both of them total, so you get four of these for ladders or bicycle racks, those will be good to use somewhere, so that's really cool to have those. And also at that same sale, I have not been able to identify this. Uh, this is a, a soda bottle. They had a bunch of them, the green ones, the old Coca-Cola ones for a dollar a piece. I passed on those. It said Salem, Oregon. This says nothing on the bottom of it, but I don't know what ro rock is. R-O-K. I have not been able to find that in the internet so far. Marquis de Pose, and it's got some Arabic or something. I don't know if that's from Saudi Arabia or where that's from. So I figured that'd be interesting for a whopping 25 cents. These were at a yard sale on a free box, uh, one of the aforementioned sales. So I grabbed some Dell speakers. They look kind of beat up, but you know, for free, I'll give them a shot or have somebody who might need them for their computer. Just give those away. And then one of the last things I bought here was this uh, um, strong box or whatever. The guy said he kept ammo in it. It was some nice older people at a sale. They wanted 250 I said, sorry, I don't have change. You get to have three. And he said, I don't mind that at all. So, um, very nice strong box here. I don't know what these label markings are on there. And it's a very, very solid box. And it's got all these latches and handles on the side here. Very, very heavy box. So if you wanted to bury something or do something with that, put some sort of thing you did not want to move around in it. A really, really cool toolbox. He had another one, but I just decided to buy one. And I thought that was very cool to have. Those are my yard sale finds and treasures, whatever. And let me know if you know anything about rock, coal, or whatever that is. And thank you for watching.